Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of New Vegas. All right, when we left off, we had just came into this facility uh, to test a new object in the Stealth Suit Mark II. Now, I don't really want to be wearing this the entire time because I don't see the point and I'll just end up damaging it to a point where I can't really repair it. So, let's take it off for right bye now. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Okay. And this guy got it hard. Dr. Callus. That's what happened with the cattle prods. Uh, he tried doing it again and they killed him very, very hard. Well then, in that case, should be a little more careful, huh? Hey. What is down here? There's nothing in that desk. Hmm. Seems like some desks fell, some terminals. A whole bunch of stuff around here. Pack of cigarettes. Oh my. There's a lot of cages. A lot of those. Ooh, wrench. Okay, let's see what's further on down here. This way... Nothing much, a couple tin cans. Nothing really useful. Another pair of eyeglasses, a laser pistol. That's not good. And that's probably where the uh, laser pistol came from. And dead end. I'm assuming you guys hear that as well as I can. That's not exactly a good thing to be hearing. Where is that coming from? Where is that coming from? Is it down here? Seems like it would be coming from down there. Night Stalker eggs. That explains the sound. Yeah, that's a... Uh, anything down here. I would think I'd be seeing something by now, don't you think? Apparently not. Let's take this preserved meat. What sort of use does this have? Preserved meat should be all the way down here. It's P. No radiation. Basically the same sort of food output as a Brahmin steak or a gecko steak. Actually, a gecko steak's more. Hmm. Yeah, that'd be pretty useful. I'll be carrying these. Pick all these up. Preserved meat and preserved meat. There we go. Those are a thing. Collect hanging meat. Oh. There we go. What is? I hear footsteps. I can swear I hear footfalls. But apparently not. Okay. Let's see if there's anything in there. Nope. Here? Nope. Not anything useful anyway. One more preserved meat. Okay. Yeah, nothing. I can just hear them. Constantly. Battle Brew! That's what we heard about. Seems like an alcoholic beverage. Intelligence goes down. Strength goes up. Uh, takes some way some hydration. In other words, dehydration. <laughs> yeah, let's pick that up, because fuck it, it's booze. Why the fuck not? <laughs> Why not to pick it up? the booze hounds of this playthrough. Take all this. There we go. Now, is there anything else that I really want to risk picking up? Not particularly. Okay, let's see if we can get down here without rousing too much suspicion. I have a feeling something will be down here. 
be able to see it. But I have a feeling it will be down here. Oh, I saw that shimmer. That is a Night Stalker. It's a cloaked Night Stalker. Fuck. Okay, in that case. Looks like I get a good shot on it. Yep, it's right over here. There we go. That was nice. Could have been worse, though. And it might have aroused another one's suspicions, so I might as well keep myself on my guard and hidden. So I have a feeling that's not the only one I'm going to be seeing. Yep. I think I saw another one. No, nope. just that one. And I'm seeing more. Okay, okay. Okay, I think that might be all of them. Reload, just in case. Uh, let's see what this one had. Eggs. Those are good. Tin can, okay. Hard to see this sort of stuff in the light. That's... Pull out my sword just in case. Another one sneaks up on me, and I have to start swinging really quickly. Night Stalker, nothing good there. Nothing good here. Nothing lootable, anyway. I can hear more. It's not a good sign. Really not a good sign. Shit. Don't like that. Don't like that at all. Hmm. Okay, there's nothing here. I don't really remember if I checked that. Oh, Nuka Cola. Could use that. Always could use that. Any other Night Stalkers in the area? Don't know. Don't really think so. Whoop. Aha! There we go. Keep hitting, keep hitting, keep hitting. Come on, damn it. Off the head goes. Okay. And that one had an egg. Any other ones? Any other ones coming? Try and take me down. I don't think so. I do not think so. And we'll just disengage the thing here. I wanted to see if the uh, gravity would start affecting the body parts. It did not. <laughs> oh well. You know, they couldn't have accounted for everything. Uh, that's not what I wanted to do at all with you. I wanted to swap back to my trail carbine because I have too much ammo for that. Should have packed more for my other guns, but hey, hindsight's 2020. Research terminal. Oh, we already did this. We already looked into this. Okay. I guess that means we should start doing the tests now, huh? <laughs> now that we know everything that's going on in this place. Scanning for authorized suit signatures. Unlock elevator to test chamber. We do have the suit on us, so I guess we don't need to be wearing it to get in here. However, we do need it for the tests. Otherwise, there's no point in running the test. <clears throat> Research terminal. Uh, server sniffer. Forward the reply to the VR test. Okay, then that's just a usual thing. Uh, there's nothing new on this terminal. Okay. Oh, this is a just openable door. Okay. I'm just gonna turn on the light on because it's easier to see half the shit. Uh, pick all this up. But this. Oh, had a lot more stuff here. I'll definitely need to head back and drop some of this shit though. 
if I plan on being able to move after all this is done. Uh oh. Hmm. What's all this? Take all this. Ammunition box. Microfission cells. Energy cells. And surgical tubing. I can use that. That's the reward safe for the tests. Alrighty. Now, there's more to this area first that I want to explore a little bit. Because that's what I do. I explore a lot more than I should. And there's a marker down here. I think those are the brains. Or something. Is I hear? I hear the uh, whir of turrets. Uh, turret treads. And well, that usually means that there is brains walking around the robo brains or something. What is this? Activate hot plate. Oh! Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. I didn't know that we had an active hot plate <laughs> in this particular spot. Uh, slasher. That is actually uh, more effective than Psycho. And it adds damage resistance, too. Although, I'm not sure how much more addictive it is than Psycho. Hmm. Still, it wouldn't hurt to make. Now, would it? Make one. There we go. And we'll see how uh, potent and effective it is later on. We try not to uh, dabble too much into those sort of drugs and whatnot. Sexy sleepwear. The fuck is doing the nasty right above the testing area? Jesus. Y'all nasty. Field gun prototype. Oh, this is the uh, email for the uh, sonic emitter. There we go. Suggestion. While Slaw is busy stuffing his face and trying <laughs> to find new places to hide his junk food from Callus, my kind of guy, I decided to experiment with a mod from one of the techs over in X8. I may not have been able to afford a doctorate like those eggheads upstairs, but I've been programming since I was in diapers. That's impressive. I found a ton of redundancies and exponential loop failures those half-wits must have missed. My fixes should speed up the refire rate on that K9 weapon they've been working on. Maybe if I leave it on one of their desks, it'll actually get implemented. Lord knows they wouldn't take me seriously if I tried to take credit. That's an idea. Hey! A main computer upgrade, Mentat Chow. That would be uh, useful if I ran that gun ever. I mean, I don't, but I could. I could hand it off to one of the uh, new uh, companions, maybe. What is this? Thin red paste? We could use this. Salient green? We could use that. What would we make with it, though? That's the thing. I'll, I'll deal with that sort of stuff on my own. Don't need to bore you guys with cooking. That's my shtick. There we go. What's over here? Nothing really important. What's over here? A bunch of drained energy cells. Someone was doing stuff. Foot locker. Duct tape. Could use that. Could use that. Uh oh. Now I'm overburdened. Uh, hmm. In that case, I'm just gonna pop. What do I got? Wine. We'll do that. We'll drink a little bit of wine. Get ourselves a little boozed up. Might as well. Before we start running the test, we might get a little clumsy with it, but what the fuck ever. Alright, test observations. I've been watching Mendoza stumble through the various X-13 tests and noticed a critical flaw in the tripwire emitter design. A skilled scientist or someone with advanced electronics repair knowledge 
could crack the casings and hack their IFF circuit to ignore the current test subject. That's an idea. I'll see if I can reinforce the casings after the leads visit the facility this week. Well, we'll find out if they actually were able to do that or not, huh? Okay then, that's an idea. See if there's any more stuff we can get into. Knew it! Knew it! I knew it! I knew it! I knew it! I knew it. All right, let's see if we can pick up any more good shit store before we start walking around. Greasy toolbox. Sugar bombs. I assume this is the uh, sloth's uh, toolbox that he's laid around. Suggestion. I've noticed your work has taken a dive lately. Oh, this is technician sloth, so I guess this is the thing. This seems to have coincided with a marked weight gain over the past few months. I've developed an implant which has been proven to increase performance while reducing weight in lab animals. Granted, we haven't run it through any human test trials yet, but I'm sure it is perfectly safe. Also, please refrain from snacking in the labs. If you smudge another camera, I'm banning all food from the facility. Dr. Callis. It's a little rude to be mentioning the weight so much, dude. A little rude. Implant Y7. What is that supposed to do? Not entirely sure, but we'll find out. To get back to the uh, auto dock. Pick all this up, because this is useful. Oh. What is this? And it doesn't even want to let me pick up that wrench. That's, that's upsetting. That is really upsetting. Metal box, Nuka Cola. Alright. Can I get to it now? No? God damn it. I want the wrench. God damn it. Alright, fuck it. Hey, deluxe chemistry set. Let's make some stim packs. See, I said I'd do it. You guys didn't believe me. You're right not to believe me. <laughs> I would have probably forgotten and just made another set of drugs. There we go. And let's make something else a little bit. We should be able to make some more, I think. There we go. Recycle those. Recycle these. And, yeah, there we go. I had a feeling that might work out that like that. Uh, need wonder glue before I make more of those. And energy cell overcharge to consolidate weight. There we go. What is over here? Some mentats. I'm no longer well rested. Crap. Uh, test recording terminal. Test area A, review. Was that Chayanov had me run through the first part of the facility to test the tripwires and proximity mines the other day, and the suit kept chafing. Maury says some new firmware updates fixed the suit's film fitment sync ability, but I'm not so sure. The legs kept binding up on me, and the torso was ridiculously tight. Maybe I should stop lifting fancy lads from Slough's stashes. That's possible, Mendoza. What the hell? Dot dot dot. <laughs> okay. What the hell is this damn problem? All I was doing was reading the latest issue of La Fant... La Fantma? La Oh, that's what it is. La Fantma. And that grouch callus called me an asshat. What the hell is an asshat anyway? Funny, haha, <laughs> my last name is Butts. <laughs> I got old in grade school to the snobby bastard. Sorry, I just needed to vent. <laughs> Butts. Okay. Alrighty then. That was weird to read. All right. How is there a body up here? Oh, I guess some of these... Uh, I guess this place might be infested with Night Stalkers too. That won't be good, I think. Is there a way to get down to the ground floor? Oh, there's another kit. There it is. We'll make some drugs this time. We'll switch on and off once we come across these between drugs and da, 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 stim packs. There we go. What is in here? Nothing in here. Nuka-Cola's something. 
and nothing. Okay. Well, now we know. <clears throat> My throat's starting to die. I apologize, folks. Damage prototype. Nokia Cola. All right. Actually, with my throat starting to die like that, this is probably a good opportunity to end the episode because it's already at time. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And take a look at my Patreon down below in the description. Decide whether or not you want to support me in making more videos for you guys or not. It's completely up to you. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one, the only, Stray Cat, playing games for you.